so we just wanted to make a quick video today just uh, another why we Wednesday so why don't we touch wild animals so there's a lot of reasons why we don't touch wild animals but we're just gonna focus on one and that is rabies so rabies although we don't think about it a lot um, it's not something that's killing people rapidly in the United States. It does kill about 60,000 people a year worldwide and in 2021 killed five people in the United States, three of which were from bat exposures. So why do we care about rabies? Rabies is almost 100% fatal once you start to develop symptoms. So once you start to develop symptoms, there's really nothing that can be done. Usually you're placed in a medically induced coma and after that, um, there's almost 100% fatality rate. So how can we prevent rabies? One of the biggest things you can do is vaccinate your pet. We do have a vaccination clinic coming up June 8th at Morningside Park. Um, it is free for Sullivan County residents. If you bring proof of um, your animal being vaccinated previously, uh, you can get a three-year vaccine. Um, if it's within the time period that they can get uh, their three-year vaccine, not too much time has elapsed. Um, free register, give our office a call, 845-292-5910. Just say that you want to pre-register for the rabies clinic. So that's one way that you can protect yourself against rabies and your pets. Um, but one big thing is that it's getting warmer. A lot of people are outside. You might want to pick up a cute little baby raccoon or something. Um, but if you do get bit or scratched by a wild animal, um, the only way to test for rabies um, if you're bit or scratched is to decapitate the animal and test the brain tissue. So as cute and lovely as that little baby fox or raccoon is, um, unless you want to go through a series of um, rabies post-exposure prophylaxis shots over the course um, of days, um, and if you don't want the animal decapitated, uh, it's best to just leave wildlife where it is. Um, especially if it's acting strangely, then you just call local authorities. But if you do get scratched or bit by an animal, um, it is something that you're going to want to seek medical attention for right away. Um, it is really important that you know you give a good narrative of what kind of animal bit you, especially if it's a wild animal. Bats are most common. Um, like I said, five people died from rabies in the United States. Uh, last year, 2021, it's the highest in uh, about a decade, uh, and three of those were from bat exposures. So sometimes they bite such small little teeth that you can't even see the puncture wounds. So that's for today's Bible Wednesday on uh, Not Touching Wild Animals.